Hello everybody, welcome to my platform. This is uh, Sichamba Jacob. All right, so I've got uh, this question with me right here where we need to find the coordinates of the intersection of these two lines. So what it means here, it means we find where these two lines are meeting. And uh, to find their intersection, we must equate them. So the first thing will be to pick one of the uh, lines. So I'll go with this one. I'll say, okay, x minus 3y is equal to a 1. So once I get this, I make one of the letters subject of the formula. Okay? So I'll go with the x. If I want, I can go with y. So I'll go with x, meaning I have to make sure that x is alone. So this will be x is equal to 1 plus 3y. So I've made these 3y uh, cross the equal sign. So to say, oh, I've added 3y to both sides. So this is it, plus 3y, you can see. Okay, so we have uh, x alone here. Thereafter, we shall get the value of x, which is 1 plus 3y. We substitute it in the other other, other line or other equation. You can see we have got two equations. We got this one, made x subject to the formula. Since we've gotten now the value of x here, we shall substitute it in the other equation. And this is how it will look like. So we shall have two open bracket, 1 plus 3y close is equal to a 5y plus a 3. So I've substituted, I've just gotten this and put it right here on the other equation. You can see it's right over here. So this entails us that we can solve for, for y. So we shall have 2 plus 6y is equal to 5y plus a 3. Thereafter, we solve for y. We shall group the like terms. So this is how it will look like. Hopefully, you know what is happening here. So we, we have this whereby y will simply be equal to what? Will be equal to a 1. 3 minus 2, it's a 1. So I've gotten now the coordinates. I mean one of the coordinates, which is a uh, which is y value. We know that this is x axis and y axis here. So for the y axis, we found one. What about the x axis? So now for the x axis, we can go back. Okay, we go back to this stage. It's fine. We go back to this stage. We know that we've got x. Or if you want, you can get this where there is y. You substitute the value of y, which is a one. Or if you want, you can move with this. But myself, I'll come right over here, where I'll say x is equal to a 1 plus 3, open bracket 1 there. So this will just be 1 plus a 3, which is a 4. So the x value in this case is what? It's a 4. So we write 4 there. So these are the coordinates of the meeting point of these two lines. This one and this one are meeting at 4, 1. Thank you so much for watching. Please remember to share, subscribe if you have not yet subscribed. Leave a comment in the comment section and bye-bye.